Hello again. Um, I've done some videos on uh, cycad seeds and pollination, harvesting, and so on. And um, many people like to cut the seeds open and test them and see what's going on inside and actually see the embryo. And that's what I want to show you today. So once we've pollinated the seed, we it then get shed from the cones, and it looks like that. Those seeds then. I've still got the flesh on and they need to be soaked in water and cleaned and then once they've been cleaned they look like that those seeds were cleaned about a month ago and they've been hung to dry out for a while and for the embryo to develop before we cut them open we do the float test again which i mentioned last time and as you can see all of those seeds are still sinking so they ought to all be fertile so let's go and cut one or two of them open this is one of the seeds we just looked at now, which was sinking in the bucket. Um, I just use a, a cutter like this, cut the seed longitudinally, like that, through the middle. And then we have a look what's going on inside. We can see, look at, let's look at these three here. That there is the root that's actually developing inside the seed and that's going to germinate and push through. Many people want to see this. This is the spring. This is the same seed. And that's the same seed in that. This is the, the little spring or the embryo that many people refer to. When you see that, you know that a seed is germinating or will germinate. Here we can see it as well on that seed and over there. There you can also see the root that is about to germinate. If you compare what you've just seen to these seeds, that is the same seed, that and that, you can see that that little spring, the embryo, is not visible anywhere here. And also the roots that we saw in the previous Natalensis seeds, these are Altensteini seeds, is also not present here. So my guess on these three seeds would be that they are not fertile and they're not going to grow.